Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here with a guide for the mastery challenge at Temple Bro Fort, the Trial of the Raven. I'm going to show you a spot inside the fort where you can poison four guards with one shot. That's right, one poisonous powder trap, four enemies dead. For my other walkthroughs, see my playlist linked on screen and in the description below. And subscribe to get my latest guides and gameplay. I'm going to start off immediately, and in less than one minute, I'm going to kill five guards. First, the one on top of this wall. And then we're going to use the chain assassination to take care of these two. Make sure they both have their backs to you before you start this move. And I'm going to hide this body in the bushes just so neither of the other two guards will detect it and alter their movements because I'm going to do the chain assassination on them as well. Again, just making sure they both have their backs to me before I start the attack. And I'm also going to hide that second body so that guard up ahead doesn't detect it. I'm going to place it in this hay. And there, I've already killed five guards using assassinations. To get a gold medal in this trial, you need to kill 15 guards using assassinations and five using poison, the poisonous powder trap ability. So I'm just waiting here to make sure the guard on the platform is not facing me before I run towards him, hugging the fence, and then climbing up onto his platform and assassinating him. Sometimes you might have an opportunity to do a chain assassination on the guard below, but I usually just scale across the wall and air assassinate him. And then hide this body as well. I'm actually not sure if the guard across the water can see this, but better safe than sorry. Now I'm going to go up the ladder and into the fort. And I'm saving my poison kills for inside the fort. I'm going to go across the rope. And I'm looking at those two guards, one directly ahead and one on the ground to my right. And I want to kill these two using a chain assassination. There's lots of ways you can do this. I mean, there's lots of ways you could do this entire mission, but this is the way that was easiest for me. And I also really like air assassinations and chain assassinations. So even though this might take a bit to get them in the right positions, it's totally worth it. So both guards have to be near the fort with their backs to the fort. And then I'm gonna air assassinate the guard directly below me and then chain assassinate the guard to my right. Sometimes they'll be in the right position as soon as you get here. Sometimes you'll have to wait a minute. All right, they're almost there. They're both gonna be walking to the spots And now I'm going to pick up the body, put it in the bushes, and check that that guard on the other side isn't facing me. He's facing me now, and then he just stopped. So once he stops, I know it's safe to cross and sneak up from behind him. I'm going to wait right here for him to come to me. And here I have an opportunity to chain assassinate the guard on the wall, but I'm going to pass because sometimes he can detect you 
or I've had him detect me while I'm doing that. So now I just wait until he passes me and then I will just climb up the wall, follow behind him and assassinate him that way. So now he's past me, I can go up behind him, stay behind him, and assassinate. And then the one below just happens to be in the spot that I need him, directly underneath. If he's not there, just wait until he gets there. And then look up. You'll see there's a guard on that wall. So when he leaves, I can move forward. If the guard isn't there, wait until he gets there. And then when he leaves, move forward. Or at least that's what I do, because otherwise there's a chance that while you're crossing the courtyard, he's going to show up and detect you. And I'm just going to hang on this ledge here. And there's a guard right ahead, but he's not going to come forward. He's not going to detect me. I'm actually waiting for the other guard to come back so I can ledge assassinate him. And if the other guard is still facing me, obviously you don't do the ledge assassination because he'll detect you. So just wait until this guard is ahead of you and there's no other guards around. And then I'm going to climb up onto the fort. And this is the spot where I shoot my poison arrow into this guard right here in the middle near the fire. And that one shot is going to kill four enemies. So that enemy is poisoned, but when he dies, he's also going to release a poison cloud. That's the miasma skill in the bear skill tree. So you can't see it on screen, but he actually poisoned another enemy. That's the second enemy near him there. So there's two enemies to my left, and then a second, a third enemy just ahead of me got poisoned by going into the cloud. So now there's one enemy that's already been killed by poison, two, two have been killed by poison. The third one, when he dies, he's going to release a poison cloud to poison that enemy near him. And now the fourth enemy is poisoned. So with just that one shot, there's a chain reaction of four guards getting killed by poison. It doesn't always work like that. Sometimes you only get three. One time I actually got five, but I guess four is probably the average. It's a little bit random, it seems to me, what the enemies do once they get poisoned, so it's hard to tell. But just wait here and don't let them detect you. And now I'm going to go back up into this corner. And there's usually a guard right below here that I need to air assassinate, but he was one of the guards that was killed by poison. So you, there may be a guard near this treasure that you have to air assassinate but he's already dead from poison, so I just go directly back here, climb up the wall and air assassinate this guard below me. And there's only two guards left. This one here that I'm gonna air assassinate to complete my assassinations. And then there's one guard left that's gonna be my final poison kill. And on the way, I'm gonna pass the bodies of three guards that died by poison. And I'm trying to get up on the roof here because I find that's a safe spot to shoot this last enemy. The enemy can detect you as soon as you shoot them, so after you shoot, duck. <laughs> and there is the final guard. And if you only killed three enemies with that first poison arrow, there'll be two guards below here that you'll need to poison. 
it can vary a little bit since once the enemies start getting poisoned, it seems to really alter their patrols and they start acting crazy. So it may vary when you try this, if you try this. But if you do, let me know how it worked out for you in the comments below. And finally, the last step is steal the treasure to complete the Temple Bro Fort Trial of the Raven with a gold medal. This is Amber. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel for more guides and gameplay.